I'm Hannah, this is Simplay Hannah, and today we're building the Forbidden Forest. And first of all, I want to mention that um, my recordings are a bit buggy in the beginning, but only for like a minute into the video. And then they're uh, working again smoothly, I don't know what the problem was. Um, but yeah, so we're building the Forbidden Forest, and we're starting off with Aragox, or Aragox, I mean Aragox section. And yeah, obviously I placed a giant spider in front of the cave. And then I placed a lot of other spiders that like come from the trees or, or are just chilling on the ground, I guess. So um, yeah, a lot of spiders. And um, first of all, I want to mention that I don't think this lot has a lot uh, to do there <laughs> but I tried placing a few items you could do anything with so um, I actually set this lot to like a house lot I guess and not a park or anything because I wanna build Grob um, and he would obviously live on the slot and I also didn't place any centaur statues or something on the slot because I found Sissy Sissy <laughs> Sissy wow okay I found Sissy um, with that it's possible to create like centaur sims um, so they're gonna live on the slot as well so yeah, obviously I'm also placing the Weasley car and next up I'm building this lake from the third movie where Harry like fights all of the Dementors and Sirius nearly dies. Um, so yeah, that's this lake supposed to be and also I placed two unicorns at the side who, I don't know, maybe want to drink out of the lake or something. But yeah, so I also placed unicorns because um, they're living in the Forbidden Forest as well. Um, and I want to also mention the traits I gave this lot. So I actually gave it only one trade and it's like that it's a private lot so people don't really come here. Um, I thought it was very fitting since it's forbidden to go in the forest. <laughs> um, and then I also made it a um, gave it lot challenges so it's an off the grid lot there are like qualies um, hanging around <laughs> and um, it's dirty yeah so that are the lot challenges I gave this lot and so now you can see me creating the unicorns with freaking knives as their horns <laughs> and next up I built like a little area where grob um, would live and obviously there aren't really everything you would need as a sim to live but um, for example I didn't place any bed um, but I placed this bush where you can woohoo in and you can also pee in so you can do that you can wash yourself in a way in anyways and I placed like this natural grill thing from Island Living um, so you can make food. Yeah, and obviously I placed a lot of objects that seem kind of trashy because Grob, I don't know, like collected some. Um, I placed a bike because in the movie he wanted to give Hermione this handlebar or, or something. Um, so I, therefore I placed a bike and yeah, useless other stuff that looked kind of cool, I don't know. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's Grob's area. But if you actually want to play on the slot with Grob or the Centaurs, I guess you maybe have to place a tent or something. I'm not sure what there are other, for other options to sleep in. But yeah, so um, uh, that's Grob's area. And next up, I think I built this little area for the fast rolls because they also live in the Forbidden Forest. Um, yeah, I just placed some of these statues who luckily looked kind of like fast rolls. Um, and I think the last thing I built was a little uh, cage thingy with a dragon in it 
Um, because in the fourth movie of Harry Potter, they, um, I guess, they they brought the dragons into the Forbidden Forest. Um, so I placed Cage with a dragon in it. Um, and yeah, that's it. So as I said, there aren't a lot of things to do here. I guess you could um, fish in the pond, no, the lake. And um, woohoo, at least you can woohoo on this lot. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can make food. But there isn't really anything else to do here. But I still thought it looked really cool. And you know, if you're playing um, in the Wizarding World and you have this lot, it's really good for stories you want to tell. So it, I don't know, it really looks cool. I also wished we could... I don't know, make like little atmospheres that looked, um, I don't know, what is the word? Um, foggy, yeah, foggy or misty. Um, but I don't know, I, I'm pretty sure there's like a machine that kind of creates fog, but uh, I didn't want to place them down here because it's an off the grid lot and I'm pretty sure they don't work then. Um, but yeah, maybe I'll do it um, afterwards, so this Forbidden Forest would also look scary. Um, yeah, so maybe I'll find a way to make it foggy or something. But um, that's basically it for the lot. And I'm really happy with how it turned out, and I actually really enjoyed building it. Uh, I didn't do it for a long time because I always didn't want to, but then I surprisingly really enjoyed it. So I hope you liked a lot as well and have a fun time with it. I don't know. <laughs> um, and oh, I forgot I have to speak through the screenshots because of the music I'm playing in the background. So you can see there's like, uh, oh, let me check out what the word is I'm searching for. It's a mailbox. I obviously had to place it on a slot because it's a house lot, but I placed it into a tree so you can see it. So yeah, I hope you all have a wonderful day and a wonderful week and goodbye!